I've been playing music in Jacksonville since I was like 13. I've been playing in different bands, played in heavy metal bands, and I went to Douglas Sanderson who played, you know, classical music, uh, jazz. I got a jazz scholarship to University of Miami. So I've done all sorts of different things around town for a while. But then I quit. <clears throat> I quit music for like four years. I didn't play anything at all. And then I started teaching guitar just to kind of make some money. And then I got back into music. I started enjoying it and wanted to make my own music. People ask, you're a good guitar player. And they say, well, play in this heavy metal band or play this, play in this. And I just kind of did whatever came my way. But when I first got into music, I like people like Ace of Base and Nine Inch Nails, like when I was a little kid. So it's kind of just, I just want to make music that's fun. Not like the jazz scene that got really competitive and all this other stuff I did for other people. It's like I just want to make music that I would enjoy listening to and just give back to the basics. It was at TSI and I know Jonathan from the Sun Bears uh, got it for us somehow. And it went pretty well. I was super nervous. I played forever, but it was the first time I've been up on stage. It's like, oh, this represents me. Like, this is my thing. And so I was all cool with it. And I finally got there and we were ready to play. And then I started freaking out. <laughs> it was just different standing up and being like, this is my music and really taking charge of it. Because even, you know, going to Douglas Sanderson and everything, playing all these concerts, it's like, well, I'm just playing what we're supposed to play and playing the piece that's in front of me and I work professionally as a guitar player and you know you never really take ownership of it it's just like well my job is to play this the right way but then stand up and be like I wrote these songs this is what I want to say this is this is what I'm about that's totally different the thing I enjoy most about this project is that I just feel freedom I don't feel any pressure to uh, be successful really <laughs> Because even though I work as a musician, um, it, this isn't what I make my money with, really. I'm not dependent on it. So I guess if you're a big band and it's really your main source of income, sometimes you start to feel that pressure of, I have to write good songs or I have to write this type of song. But I, I work with other people's music, you know, primarily to uh, make my living. So then when it comes to this, I'm just like, well, now I just get to have fun. But there's a... Ian Kelly plays bass, and he's a very great bass player, so happy to have him. He plays uh, around town in a lot of different bands. And then Josh Berlin, he also is a professional musician, he's a drummer. And then Katie Spencer uh, plays in the band, she sings or plays keyboards and helps write a lot of the songs. So they're all my best friends, and uh, they're all great musicians and really creative people. Only this moment Only for you Only this moment Only for you
imagine love without pain life without death just me and you no need to think about the rest imagine love without pain life without death just me and you no need to think about the rest